Hello, my YouTube fam out there. Today, I am gonna. Well, I got a few a few episodes to go before I do my Creative Coins episodes, but I wanted to show you in the process of doing that those videos what I have collected since then. And I'm sorry that these coin these quarter holders are actually a bit bigger than quarters. Sort of sucks, but nothing can we really do about it. What we're looking at right here is a 1968 proof quarter that's an s and before you say well that doesn't look like a proof quarter because a proof quarter looks like that 1982 but let's turn it sideways for you as you notice the um 1968 is a proof quarter 1982 is also a proof quarter but the 68 looks a lot different and I, at first, you know, I thought that was like an error or something like that. And I actually looked up the 1968 quarter, and it actually looks just like that for a proof quarter. And I, let's see here. As you see, they move around a lot. I mean, it has that mirror-like finish like the proof quarter is supposed to have for 1968. So that's actually pretty good. I mean, I'm looking at it, not through the camera, but with the light hitting it, and it has a beautiful shine on it. So let's put it right back there. So as you say, you saw the 1968 proof quarter. You saw the 1982 proof quarter. As you can see, the back looks about it looks the same as the front, the picture being glossed over, I guess you want to call it, as well as the, wor as well as the words. It's a very beautiful quarter. But that's not it. <clears throat> I also got this proof quarter, 1991. I mean, as I'm looking at it, the words and the date on the front of this quarter are not glazed over like those ones are, as you can tell. So, one of us like a partial proof quarter. <laughs> I don't know. But, oh, back on it. As you can see, it's a beautiful proof quarter that I keep moving around and doing damage to. Doug on it. But that's not the last one I gotta show you. This is the last quarter I collected. As you can see, it's a bicentennial proof quarter. All the quarters I have are S quarters. As you can tell by the mint mark right there. So it is a good proof quarter. So I basically have a four proof quarter set. If I had the other proof quarter I have, it means I have five proof quarters. And I think the other one's also bicentennial proof quarter. But still, what do you think of the collection? Isn't that nice? This is just one set of the coins I have collected in the process of me making other videos for you, my viewers and my subscribers out there but like i said until next time you guys have a wonderful evening bye